We have to plant all these seeds. Luckily, with all of us helping, it shouldn't take too long. What do you want us to plant this year? I really like tomatoes, but I also like oranges and melons, and I also like watermelons and giant pumpkins and... Moo Moo, we don't have enough room to plant so many things. You have to choose just one. Tomatoes. Very good, tomatoes. What else, Alfred? I really like carrots a lot. And lettuce to Lolo. Well, what I really like are sausages. I like sausages too, but we can't plant them. Why can't we plant them? Everybody got to choose something to plant, and I didn't say anything. I want to plant sausages. Rita, sausages are neither fruits nor vegetables. We can't plant them. I know perfectly well that sausages can be planted, and I'm going to demonstrate. While Rita plants sausages, we're going to plant seeds. Mumu, you plant the tomato seeds. Alfred, you put in the carrot seeds. Talalo, you put in the lettuce seeds. And I'll plant the pumpkin seeds. You, Milo, you can plant the potatoes. Now, let's all get to work. Olga, how long does it take to grow tomatoes? Well, it takes about five or six months for them to grow and be ready to eat. I thought that tomatoes were grown in the supermarket, in their little containers, in their little rows, all neat and organized. Yes, Mumu, tomatoes are sold in the supermarket, but first somebody has to plant them like you're doing now. Then they need to be watered for many months, and they need to get a lot of sun. And only then will they grow into delicious, ready-to-eat tomatoes. And how long will Rita's sausages take to grow? When they see how these sausages grow, they're going to realize their big mistake. I'll put one sausage here and another here. This one looks so good. Then I'm going to eat it. Nom, 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 nom. That was really good. Now I'm a little hungry. I can eat another one since I still have a lot left. I'm going to keep on planting sausages. Another here and another here. Now I only need to wait about 10 minutes. Nom, 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 nom. Hello, Rita. Have you already planted your sausages? Yes, I've already planted all these. And do you really think they're going to grow? Well, of course, Momo. Soon we'll have the same sausages, but a whole lot bigger. That's how large sausages are made. Ah. May I eat one? They just look so good. All right, Moo Moo, but just one. While you're there, could you get one for me as well? It's amazing how much I like sausages. Well, I really like tomatoes, but they take so long to grow that I don't know if I'll be able to wait five months without tasting them. You have to wait five months? Yes. How long do you think it'll take for your super sausages to grow? Well, I don't know, but I was thinking five minutes. But if we have to wait so long, we might as well eat them now, right? Rita, you're hungry, aren't you? So catch this one and eat it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This one is so good. Now I'll throw you one. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Throw me another one. Now you to me. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't have any sausages left. Now what am I going to tell Olga when she sees I didn't plant anything? Rita, did you really believe that if you planted sausages in the ground, they'd grow? Now that you mention it, it's possible that there's a slim possibility that they wouldn't. But since Olga's always right, I had to contradict her. 
When Olga comes, just tell her that you made a mistake and that you didn't want to plant sausages. Tell her that you wanted to plant zucchini. Those will definitely grow if you plant them. Hi, Rita. Hi, Mumu. We've already planted everything in the vegetable garden. Tomorrow we need to go and water them. What's wrong, Rita? Why are you looking at me like that? I'm not looking at you in any way. It's my way of looking. Rita? Is something wrong? I thought you were going to plant sausages. The truth is that I did plant them. But we were so hungry that Mumu and I ate them all. It's true, they were really good. But Olga, I already knew that sausages don't grow on the ground. Don't think that I'm not as clever as you are. Come on, Mumu, let's go. We need to plant a uh, zucchini. Milo, what are zucconis? In Rita's world, there's something like zucchini. Uh, 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 pass it to me. Now to uh. me. Now back uh. to me. What's this? Is anyone going to pass it to me or what? Pass it to me already. Oh. 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 Uh. Wow! Talalo, that shot was incredible! Now we have to go look for it. Come with me. You can see a lot better from the sky. How did you get to be so strong, Talalo? Look at how many apple trees there are. And they're all full of apples. It's incredible. You're right. Talalo, next time you need to kick it softer. Look at the ball. It's right under the apple tree. Let's go get it. That's what you get for kicking the ball so hard. <laughs> huh? <laughs> oh. Where's that laughter coming from? <laughs> huh? I haven't laughed so much in a long time. <laughs> it was pretty funny, wasn't it? Mr. Apple Tree, why are you so far away from the other apple trees? Well, you see, I was born in this place. And it never bothered me to be a bit farther away from my brothers. This way I can grow bigger and be more comfortable. But this year it hasn't rained very much and I haven't gotten any water. My brothers have been able to grow many apples, but I haven't been able to grow a single one. As you know, what we apple trees like to do most is grow apples, so that everyone can taste how good they are. Uh-huh. Is there anything we can do to help you? Not unless you can make it rain and make the wind take all these dead leaves away. Anyway, I hope that one day you can taste my apples. We've got to go now, Mr. Apple Tree. But don't you worry. We'll try and help you real soon. My friends, we need to help Mr. Apple Tree. The poor guy has no water and hasn't been able to produce any apples. Um, what can we do to help? What a great idea, Talalo. We'll make Mr. Apple Tree as good as new. It's raining. I can't believe it. Water! Lots of water! This is totally awesome! It's you! Thank you so much for doing this! Oh! Hey! 
Hey, look at Mr. Tree. He's got flowers growing out of his head. That's strange, isn't it? Moo Moo, those flowers grow out of all the apple trees. And they will all turn into apples in just a few days. Good morning, Mr. Apple Tree. You sure have a lot of flowers now. All those flowers are so pretty. Thank you, my friends. When my apples are ripe, you can eat as many as you like. That's great. I want a basketful just for me. We'll check back soon to see how many apples there are. See you tomorrow. It's amazing how many apples there are. Hurry, hurry. Come here, everyone. You are not going to believe this. It's incredible. I see hundreds and hundreds of apples. It's awesome how many there are. Are all of you ready? Are we ready for what? Whoa. <laughs> Yay! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Look how many I have. I have even more. Thank you, Mr. Apple Tree, for so much fruit. They are all for you, for having been so kind. See you later. That was a lot of fun. We should go to the forest and look for trees, and if we see that they're dry, we'll give them lots of water. Yes, it's wonderful. Look how many apples Mr. Apple Tree has given us. Everyone, look at me. I'm a tree with flowers on my head, and these apples are so good. Um. Mm, mm. Last night, I had a really strange dream. I was shopping at the finest shops in the world, and just when I was getting ready to pay, I noticed my wallet was empty. There was no money left since I had already bought so many things. So then a policeman came and This said, chatterbox won't stop talking. I don't even know what she's talking about. All the buttons in the store. And of course, how am I supposed to sew with this tight thimble and prickly needle? I hope we're heading home soon. It's almost tea time. Alfred, uh, huh? are you listening to me? I said, which one shall I buy, the blue or the green? I can't help you there. Sorry to tell you this, but you're very inconsiderate. The breeze is picking up. That cute little jacket I bought sure would come in handy now. Excuse me, Miss Giraffe. Would you like to dance with me? To dance? Hmm. Oh, no way. No, I don't dance. <laughs> oh, don't cry. I'm sure you'll find someone to dance with you. Nobody will dance with me because I'm all alone. And when the wind blows, I'd like to dance with another flower. Today's your lucky day, little Miss Flower. I'm going to go get my friends now, and we'll come right back to help you. Really? Thank you so much. You're a nice giraffe. Well, yes, nice and elegant. I'll be right back. How's it going? Please, everyone, come here. This is really important. I've got to tell you something super important that just happened to me. I just forgot. Wow, I can't remember. Uh, let me think. I was with Alfred, telling him about my dream, and... Uh, oh, I've got it! I'll tell you about my dream. Well, I was shopping at the finest shops in the world, and just when I was getting ready to pay, I noticed my wallet was empty. <laughs> Forgive me for interrupting you, Rita, but what are you talking about? My dream? What's the matter? You want to hear it again? No, no, please don't. Once was more than enough for me. I thought you were going to help the poor flower that you met. Oh, yeah, the flower. I totally forgot about her. Olga, we've got to help move that flower to a new spot. Let's go and see that flower. Hello, Miss Flower. What's the matter? 
Nobody dances with me because I'm all alone. And when it gets windy, I just wish I could dance with somebody next to me. Well, let me tell you what we're going to do. We are going to replant you right next to the other flowers so you can dance with them whenever you like. Thank you so much. You are all so nice. That's very easy. You just cut the flower and put it next to the others. No, 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 no. You can't do that. If you cut me, I would die in less than a day. You have to take me out of here by digging a hole in the ground, right below me, so that you don't cut my roots. Don't you worry, Miss Flower. I've been gardening for a long time, and I know just how to do it. Olga, pass me a shovel, please. I don't know where it is. I think we left it near the swings. Rita, could you do me a favor and go get the shovel? Yeah, right, since I've got nothing better to do. Please, go on, Rita. It'll just take a moment. We'll stay here and keep Miss Flower company. All right, I'll go. <laughs> Let's see, now where do I find the shovel? Let me think. I believe it's under the slide. No, it's not under here. Maybe it's by the swings. Not here either. What bad luck. Uh, maybe, oh, I know. It must be in the sandbox. Yay, I finally found it. I found it. It was right where I thought it would be. Okay, now I'm going to replant her. Hey, no way. I want to do it all by myself. She's my friend. But Rita, it's very complicated. If you do it wrong, the flower will die. Hmm. I don't want to discuss it with you. Either I do it, or the flower stays here forever. Milo, don't worry. I'm sure Rita will do the best she can. I'm sure everything will turn out fine. All right, as you wish. Rita, be very careful. You need to dig a hole just below the flower but leave a little bit of space so that you don't cut the roots. Don't worry, this is easy as pie. Very easy. Slowly, slowly. I don't even want to look. Like that, well done. I've got it. See how easy? Very good. Now you have to put her with the other flowers. Very carefully, Rita. much, my friends. Now I'm the happiest flower in the garden. And now let's all dance. Moo Moo, Talalo, come quick. We're all going to dance together. 